Hey everyone, GraphicsWorks here, and we are back with another episode of Mun Daily. Uh, so we are. Oh, there we go. Uh, so far, we are, have found a key, and it's taken us to this dungeon inside this tower that's in the woods from the previous fallen kingdom back in the day. Michael stood in front of a long stone corridor, lighting it up with phone's flashlight. Putting fears and doubts inside, he stepped inside into the darkness. On his way through, he saw torches and banners on the walls that became clearer, too. And so Michael got to the corridor that looked more like a prison under the castle. Oppression of this place was growing. Tunnels on different sides were confusing our hero. Suddenly, two figures jumped out of one of these tunnels, leaving Michael unconscious with one precise hit. Unknown figures grab him by the hands and drag him down the corridor. What happened to our hero next? You see now. Oh no. What's going on here? We're tied up. Who's that duck looking thing? Oh, some sort of swan. Haas! Oh, you're finally awake. I was afraid that Riley hit you too hard. Sorry for the act of kidnapping, please. It wasn't my idea. I would never do that. Listen, you're not a thief, right? While well, silence means agreement, let me untie you and lead you to the castle. We need to talk to Riley. Another thing, my name is Haas. I'm from the Royal Guard. And done. You're free. Follow me now. The Royal Guard? So, did he, like, travel through time? Interesting. Dagrat's walkway. Whoa. What's that? Is that a tree? What's going on here? What? How's the view? It's Dargrat, our underground kingdom. On the left, it's castle. We're heading there. In the middle is the United District. It's the main one. Okay. Oh, I guess there's like a town next to that waterfall. I didn't see that before. Okay, I think I talked too much. Sorry. Let's go to the castle instead. This walkway leads to it. Okay. Castle Gardens. Okay, we got more of these uh, humanoid animal peoples. So here we are. Lobby of the castle is right behind these doors. We will be met by Corsic. Maybe Riley is there too. Also worry not. Everything's fine. We just need to talk to Riley. Come in when you're ready. Okay. So. I can't talk to them. What if I go this way? Is there anything over here? Nope. Okay, so I guess all I can do is just go inside. Karin. Riley, I've told you that it is dangerous. But you once again didn't listen to me, made a mess in the caves, and kidnapped a person. And what do we need to do with him now? 
go call for Hass and that man. Uh, we can't meet anyone like that, even strangers. Okay, Riley. God damn it, Dad! He took my stuff and was heading here through the dungeons. At least managed not to break anything. We stunned him, threw in the cell, and took all the items. He is some kind of a thief, and I didn't let him get here. What did I do wrong? I didn't lock him in a cell for nothing. It was... Human from the surface? No, oh, that's probably not what he'd sound like. Oh, what? What? Did he just kiss him? And there is this human person. Corsic, what has gotten into you? Oh, I'm I'm sorry. I read a lot about humans in library and, and wanted to see a real one, and there he is. Oh, oh, so I guess it was a hug. It looked a lot like a kiss. I lost my mind a bit. Sorry, King. Hass, why did you bring him here? I've told you to hold him in the cell. And even there you try to be a good guy and release our suspect. Well, excuse me, princess. Okay, Legend of Zelda reference. Hey, calm down. Everything is alright. And you, human, present yourself. Uh... I'm Michael. And what did you, human, forget in our kingdom? I found a key in a broken tower on the surface, and it, it has opened a hatch into the caves that brought me here. So was... And why the hell did you go into those caves, and even open the hatch with my own key? Because of you, I had to go for a new one, only to lock it up. Riley, stop it. I will have a talk with you later. But at least now, I completely understand what happened. Here in Darget, uh, Dargrat, uh, we barely know anything about modern humans, and of course we have not seen them. And right here is such an opportunity. We should fix our old mistake. Meet this human from the surface. Get to know each other better. Learn about their life. But how can I say it? Mm, I do not think that I am capable of organizing such a meeting today. Alright, Michael the human, I command you to return here tomorrow, and I will be able to greet you in a proper manner. Dad, are you serious? Ah, she's so peeved. I, I, I can't take it anymore. Huff, 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 huff. So pissy, pissy, pissy. <laughs> Made a scene again, as always. Hee <laughs> hee. Stop it. Oh, by the way, Hass, could you escort human uh, to one of the exits? No problem. Well, Michael, let's go. You'll return here tomorrow. See you later, Michael the human. Indeed. See you later. I will be waiting. Okay, that was odd. What just happened? I don't even know myself. Corsic hug. Okay, it was a hug. All right. Um, Riley got angry at me. King Kahar, Kar Kar invited you for a dinner. Okay, and I need to come back here tomorrow. Yes, there will be a special appointment prepared for you. I guess I don't have a choice anymore, right? It all seems like a dream. 
I need to get back home. Come with me through the city, I will lead you out the second exit. Let's get down to the United District, we'll go through it, it will not take long. Okay. This is some kind of like Narnia stuff. This is really cool. Cafe. Do 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 do. Water district. Where am I supposed to go? Left or right? You didn't say what direction to go in. And I'm the one leading instead of following. Forest? Michael, this path leads away from the exit. We may get stuck here for a while. Maybe turn around. I still need to get back home. Alright, let's turn around. Okay, so it'll, it would direct me if I had went the wrong direction. Don't overfill the bakery. Here we are. It's one of the exits. Up there, it's after the ladder. There will be a hatch and a... Oh, right, you need a key. Almost forgot. Silly me. Take it. Tomorrow, after the stuff king will prepare you'll take your items back they are in Riley's room and I really hope she will not try to kick you out like me anyway until we meet Michael I don't don't tell anyone about this right hmm don't eat mushrooms do not overfill the bucket do not eat mushrooms didn't want anyway they look weird okay that's a chair what the hell is this? Someone has sculpted a chair out of stone? Reminds me of those videos where entire houses were dug out of dirt. Yeah. Michael was finally alone with his thoughts after everything that happened. He soon went back home on the surface. His path was lit by foliage similar to leaves of that big tree. As they were getting brighter, Michael got closer as if they sensed him. In the end of the tunnel, there was a hatch. Hass mentioned it. Michael used the gifted key to open, and the cave's look filled the smell of dust and wood. Opened the hatch and led already familiar to Michael's house on the edge of Mundili. What? Well, that was crazy. I'll better get home already and get my head together. Roadhouse. So if I leave... Oh, okay, so that's what that was for. Interesting. Alright, let's go home and get some sleep. Michael's house. The next day, in the castle. In the castle, special appointment was taking place. King mentioned it yesterday. Except for our hero Michael, at the dining table was sitting the king himself, Hass, the guard, and Corsic, the castle's butler. Okay, interesting. So, Corsic's the butler. Princess Riley did not show to this occasion at all, and the queen's place wasn't even served. I won't retell you everything they were just talking about because it was just ordinary questions but to which local inhabitants did not know the answer. Can't remember now how much time has passed during this dinner but sadly it has eventually come to an end. Now we can focus on Michael's main objective here, take his items back. About time to get something done. I was told that items are in Riley's room and the room should be in this direction. Okay. Alright guys, and with that I'm going to end this video here. 
Um, I hope you guys are enjoying the Mundili series so far. It's really interesting that it's kind of like a uh, Narnia mixed with... Uh, I can't... What's the other thing? Uh, hmm. I can't remember. It, but it's like Narnia mixed with something where it's like you go through this portal, this trapdoor, this broom closet, and you enter in this fantasy world of kings and knights and queens and all that. So it looks really interesting. I'm really enjoying this game so far. <coughs> and uh, I hope you guys are enjoying it too. If you wouldn't mind hitting the subscribe button, that would really mean a lot to me. Uh, hit the like button if you enjoyed the video, if you're enjoying the game. Uh, if you want to play this too, uh, I'll leave a link to the game in the description down below as well as all my socials you can find me at. And as always, I hope y'all have a good one, and I'll see you around. Bye.